The Lord showed me something. First of all, I want to give you a warning to be away from friends. The friends you have are not the people you're supposed to call your friends. Are you getting me? So anything you want to do, I want you to keep it to yourself. The Spirit of God is upon you. If nobody has told you, I'm telling you now. That means you have a gift of oppression of God. If anybody has told you, I'm telling you now. But because you have not found it fit, and noticed to see it, but that's not why I called you out. Why I called you out is that God positioned this young man to be a blessing to his family. Now the Lord took me to your father's house in the village. Then God told me that in that family there is no peace. I saw where there is fighting. What I mean about fighting, kindred fighting within the family range of your family. Eh? Yes, sir. Now, as I'm talking to you, I saw where that the fighting I'm seeing is as now is supposed to go to court fighting, but now it has gone to spiritual fighting. Yes, that it is so serious that it has caused everybody in that family no prosperity anywhere. I don't know if I'm talking to you. I hear you, sir. Now, it has caused everybody, nobody's growing. Now, even when your father would have been a very blessed person. Yes, sir. Your father hustled very well. Yes, sir. There was a time the Lord blessed your father and your father needed to build a benefited house. Yes, sir. He only ended up in building a house that has only three rooms. And a parlor. Yes, sir. Rooms is different from parlor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's only what your father built. Yes, sir. Mm. Oh, now hear me I now saw where you appear you now your face now turn like a lion I ask God why. God says that he gloated you that even in that house they fear you no matter how you know you look but you are the one they see and everybody will keep quiet when they want to go the other way around. Yes sir. It's true sir. Now but what God is showing me is that the same you God has gloated we face almost all the battles. Yes sir. But there is something I am seeing. Can I prophesy to somebody here? Yes, sir. When God has raised you and your foundation says no, I disconnect you from that foundation. Amen. And now, you are doing everything you are doing to come out of the age. Now, everything you are putting in your hands fails at the age of the success. That has been the problem. Yes, sir. Yeah, that is what I want to see. Uh, sir, you want to see me? Yes, sir. Uh, and I said, I want to see you. Say, I'm not a professor. Yeah. Pay no gana, go. Ha gana, gando. Hold it down. Hear this. Hear this. The angel of love spoke to me. Anything you want to do in that house, don't discuss it with anybody. Okay, sir. I saw a mouth speaking fire. I asked God, he said, friends, anything friends. <laughs> friends. Anything relation, anything that will cause you to discuss with anybody. Yes, sir. When I'm referring to friends, it might not be friends you already have. Oh. I get you, sir. Nah, nah, get you. You. Sir, what the Lord... <laughs> So am I talking here? Yes, sir. I, you are talking clear. Very clear. Very clear. Hey. Can I prophesy to somebody here? Yes, sir. The Lord will talk clear to you. Amen. Sir. The solution I want to give you will shock you. Okay, sir. Before you go now, you are lucky that it rained. Go and use something. Pack water from it. Put it on the bottle. Yes, sir. Eh? Yes, sir. I saw where you were lying flat and you were rolling yourself in a dirty water. And as I'm asking, the angel spoke to me that as you are standing here, you look fresh, 
dressed well, as if you are a young man that is doing one or two things and you are seeing light. He said that the young man is frustrated. Am I talking here? You are talking. That he is like somebody who is at the middle of the road that doesn't know whether he will follow front, left, or right. And that is confusion. He said I should tell him to get a water. So it's better you don't go on the road to get it. You can get it from the one in the church since he ran today. Now you mix it from the water you're going to use to take your bath. You tell God, every reproach, any kind of reproach of death, deathiness, that's what I call death, not death of dying, death of the eye. Uh -huh. I, have, I have good students here. That any kind of death persuaded on me by one demonic spirit, manipulated from anywhere, foundation or anything. That as you're using this death to wash your body, that that spiritual death is dead. When you finish it, two buckets of water will be there. When you finish it, you will now go back again in this at the same time and take back with a new and neat water. Yes, sir. And that water, the new one, will be consecrated with Psalm 24. The earth is of the laws and the fullness thereof. Every gate of the lady's appointment shall be lifted up so that the king of glory shall come. After you prayed on it, you will read another psalm, Psalm 1, that you are like a tree planted by the riverside that bringeth forth its fruit in its season. And that whatsoever you do it, you shall prosper. Amen. So immediately you take that back with the neat water. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. I hear something. Ah. Abonye, geburu mi bo. Obana chideke, obagi geburu muti. After you do it, anybody here, the enemy has positioned wrongly. I reposition you to the office God has given to you. Amen. When you Asim <laughs> Sir, immediately you finish taking that bath, you wear the one of the best clothes you have. Spray perfume. You're going to walk like an extent of a street to a street. When you are walking, you are doing shakara. There is something I am saying. I am seeing a new door opening to you. But you need to possess it before the physical reality uh, and manifestation. And when you now take that clothes, you put in that buffet. The Lord showed me that when you walk from one street and down there, only once, you walk majestically, comfortably. And you are getting a make it. I hear this. Then after you walk down, you now went, you go home, remove the clothes and relax. Then the Lord spoke to me that a door will open. A favor will come. Okay, so come with it. And I don't know if I'm saying something. Amen. Hear this. Don't cry. If you cry, I will stop. Hear this. The Lord wants to use you to remove tears in your family. Amen. Your family is a laughing stock. 
But God has ended it now. Amen. I said, your family is a... Oh, okay, God has ended it. So, your family was a laughing stock. But God has put in a smite spiritually. Amen. And the manifestation will come from you. I don't know who... The, there is somebody the Lord will use to help you. And the favor will just come straight. But remember that from this altar, that deliverance has come. Amen. Go and be blessed.